Zoom at the top, despite the promising title, is a really slow cartoon. And I have to say, it is surprisingly slow. Wile E. Coyote and Roadrunner cartoons, by their very nature, are usually very quick. We go from one attempt after the other. But with this one, things just seem to play out for a really long time. This is a Warner Brothers cartoon from 1962, directed by Chuck Jones and Morris Noble, written by Chuck Jones. And we have Mel Blanc very briefly voicing the coyote, um, which did take me by surprise. And the things he tries are, are not very interesting. The, the thing with the ice, I thought worked quite well. But interestingly, I think that was actually the quickest thing that happened, which is unfortunate. But everything else just seemed to take forever, especially with the bear trap. I won't say what happens with that or, you know, how it comes about, but it was really slow and I just did not enjoy it at all. Usually with Wile E. Coyote and Roadrunner cartoons, if you don't care for one aspect of it, that's fine because it very quickly moves on to something else. But that just wasn't the case with this one from start to finish, excluding the thing with the ice, which I, as I said, I did kind of like, it was really dull. And I'm really disappointed by that. Thankfully, there are about a million other Wile E. Coyote cartoons to enjoy. So it's not the end of the world. But I, I wish I liked it more. Zoom at the Top is not one I'll be watching again. And I'd only recommend it if you're planning on watching all of them. Because it's not bad in the sense that it's offensive or anything. It's worth watching to tick it off of your list. But if you've never seen a Wile E. Coyote cartoon before, maybe avoid Zoom at the Top.